It's my esteemed honor to introduce and welcome His Excellency Sheikh Nahyan bin Mubarak Al Nahyan for his opening remarks. Thank you, sir. Your Majesty, King Carl the 16th, Gustav of Sweden, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor to be with you today to celebrate the National Day of the Kingdom of Sweden. I warmly welcome you to the United Arab Emirates and to the Expo 2020 Dubai. Sweden had been a remarkable presence in World Expo since its first participation in the Great Exhibition of 1851 in London. Since in London, as well as significant role in hosting specialized expos in 1936, 1949, and 1955. And so we are privileged to have you here with us participating with one of the most unique pavilions at Expo 2020 Dubai. This year holds a special place in the heart of every Emirati as it has been filled with remarkable milestones from the UAE's Hope probe going into a successful orbit in February to hosting Expo 2020 Dubai to make marking the golden jubilee of our beloved nation. As we look back on how far, how far we have come, with the support of our friends and partners from all corners of the globe, and look forward to another 50 years filled with more significant achievements. We are pleased that you are joining us on this special journey. We firmly believe that our Expo is an opportunity for us to collectively shape a safer and more sustainable future for generations to come. Our theme, connecting minds, creating the future, motivates us to move forward in the right direction. Your Majesty, Sweden's participation underlines the importance of focusing on sustainability in every aspect, whereby the Swedish woodlands combined with the Islamic geometric design to inspire both the architecture and the storytelling of the pavilion. The theme of Sweden's exhibition promotes the country as an innovative, sustainable, and business-friendly nation, which strongly believes that dedication and joint commitment are essential to realizing the powers of creativity and innovation. In addition, visitors to the pavilion will be given the opportunity to learn about how Sweden is building smart cities, developing the next generation of travel, innovating the field of life sciences and developing a biocircular economy. And for that, I would like to express our appreciation to Your Majesty, King Carl XVI Gustav, and to the Commissioner General, His Excellency Jean Teslev, and his team for Sweden's outstanding participation in this Expo 2020 Dubai. As a young nation and the, and in, uh, the first in the Middle East, Africa and South Asia region to host the World Expo, the UAE is looking forward to strengthen economic and cultural ties with countries around the world. The UAE is proud 
to be Sweden's second largest export market in the Arab world and home to more than 250 Swedish companies that have been vital in the development of our nation over the last 40 years. Particularly within the construction, health sector and environmental fields and many others, we greatly appreciate the continued commitment that Sweden has extended uh, to the UAE. Sweden has also been a reliable and cooperative partner of ours in various fields of mutual interest, such as energy, technology, business, and education, and we hope to build on the existing partnership between our countries as we explore new areas of collaboration during the months of the Expo and beyond. With this, I welcome you again, Your Majesty King Carl XVI Gustav, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, as we gather together today at Expo 2020 Dubai to capitalize on our shared experiences, engage in dialogues and collaborate towards the making of a new world for us and future generation to come. Your Majesty, thank you very much and God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you, Your Excellency. Now please join me in welcoming this morning's honoree from the Kingdom of Sweden. His Majesty King Carl the 16th Gustav for his remarks. Highness, Excellencies, Ministers, Ladies and Gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you very much for the warm welcome. I am delighted to be back in the United Arab Emirates and uh, to visit this uh, Expo 2020. When um, I ascended the throne of Sweden in 1973, a long time ago. His Highness Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan al Nayan, may he rest in peace, was the president of the UAE. This young federation was then at the start of its uh, 50 years journey that has led us here today. Being here reminds me of a quote by Sheikh Sayed that is well known to all emeritus. A nation without a past is a nation without a present or a future. It is um, inspiring to see that even with the UAE's impressive development, Emirates continue to live by his creed. The UAE's past, present and future is truly reflected here at the Expo 2020, as well as throughout this nation. It is my pleasure to uh, congratulate you all on the occasion of e UAE's Golden Jubilee. Our two countries have excellent 
bilateral relations and uh, share a desire to strengthen them further. We also face many common challenges, including the need to build sustainable cities and to, to work, to work together against climate change. In dealing with these challenges, Sweden and the UAE stand united behind one word, and that is innovation. Innovation has played a crucial role in Sweden's economic growth and development. This has um, had a profound benefit across all parties of our society, and it still does today. According to uh, global ranking, Sweden is one of the most innovative countries in the world. And all of Sweden takes part in making this possible. Women and men, young and old, students, researchers and companies. We innovate together and we create together. Meanwhile, the UAE has made innovation a central element of its economic development. It is telling that in 50 years since the creation of the UAE has reached into space with the hope marsh props, which will provide new knowledge for the benefit of all. Furthermore, it is inspiring that 80% uh, of the scientific team team of the Emirate Marsh mission are women. It is my hope that the UAE will continue its ambition to include all parts of its society to drive Emirati innovation. Innovation is not born in a vacuum. Innovation thrives through co-creation or co-creativity. Simply put, we are smarter together than apart. And through innovation, we are able to find common solutions to common challenges. This is on display, clearly on display here at the Expo 77, Twen including the Swedish pavilion, the forest, which shows Swedish innovation and uh, sustainability in, uh, in practice. Yesterday, I had the op opportunity to visit the pavilion myself. I, well, I was proud and pleased with what I saw there. And I invite you all to explore it for yourself. The engagement for, of Swedish companies and organizations is also impressive. Some uh, 143 partners, sponsors and organizations and suppliers have joined us here at the Expo 2020. Expo gives us the possibility to uh, develop innovative solutions, not just for, for good of our own country, but uh, for a global market and for the global good. It is true opportunity. It is a true opportunity for co-creation for innovation. I am confident that the partnership created here at the Expo will strengthen cooperation between Sweden and the UAE and the countries of the world and that that we will be able to generate new ideas and solutions together so I wish you all participants and visitors an enjoyable and successful Expo 2020 
Dubai. Thank you and good luck. Thank you, Your Majesty. We are now pleased to share a cultural performance where you will experience a once in a lifetime presentation that features the leading Scandinavian circus company that also calls Sweden its home. This contemporary circus company, Circus Circor, has created the performance specially made for today, and it's based on the idea of co-creation, which is at the very heart of the circus arts. But first, you will hear from one of the most well-known Swedish artists and songwriters. She has released five studio albums, headlined multiple sold-out tours, and won several prestigious awards for her music, for sure. You might even recognize her voice as she recorded the singing voice for Rachel McAdams and Netflix's Eurovision movie, and received an Oscars nomination for the best original song with the song Hosavik. Here now proudly representing the Kingdom of Sweden, please welcome Molly Sandin to the stage of nations. hasn't been my best year It hasn't been my worst year But on this day of late December It's hard to remember Whatever was the point I lost a lot of money I said the worst things to my honey Maybe drank a bit too much I lost some of my touch To whatever was the point But tomorrow's Christmas Day Come whatever, come what may I'll be singing in the choir Join the children by the fire Though I'm pointless, I will stay and I guess I'll be okay Come whatever, come what may It hasn't been my best year It hasn't been the first year That I've been walking around confused Half asleep and half refused To whatever was the point if you see me in a corner Please don't treat me like a stranger Take my drink and send me up No, don't leave me there alone Whatever is the point Cause tomorrow's Christmas Day Come whatever, come what may I'll be singing in the Join the children by the fire, though I'm pointless, I will stay. Come whatever, come what may, I'll be singing in the choir. Join the children by the fire, though I'm pointless, I will stay. And I guess I'll be okay. Come whatever, come what may And I guess I'll be okay Come whatever, come what may Thank you so much. It's so lovely to be here. This next song is going to be in Swedish and it's about the best is yet to come. Du längtar efter nästa steg 
Men jag hoppar att bästa mig Vi vill alltid samma saker Nu är jag inte lika säker Skulle jag förlåta mig Om jag skulle lova dig allt det där För jag är inte riktigt klar än Tänk om jag kommer ångra mig sen Vi sitter i mitt rymde Vi fastnar ju på molnen Och jag vill stanna kvar här nu Men du vill inte ta vägen ut Får jag och vågar du och vågar vi släppa tag Innan jag har någon ögon när vi träffar marken Stay Ska vi våga tänka tanke Det bästa kanske inte händer Får jag och vågar du och vågar vi släppa tag Innan jag har någon ögon när vi träffar marken Stay Ska vi våga tänka tanke det bästa kanske inte hände Du kan se att jag är bra men hemma bäst Men väljer ändå bort till mig Men kanske är det allt för ofta Jag hellre sover kvar på sofan Och kärlek har en explosion Men lågen är så stort att det är ändå för få Nu fyller vi med sluten tystan Fråga men har slutat lyssna Vågar jag, vågar du, vågar vi släppa tag Innan jag har någon ögon när vi träffar marken Säg, ska vi våga tänka tanke Det bästa kanske inte händer Vågar jag, vågar du, vågar vi släppa tag Innan jag har någon ögon när vi träffar marken Säg, ska vi våga tänka tanke det bästa kanske inte händer Men jag kan inte längre blunda För allt det där jag tycker runda Hur mycket vågar tiden vänta Hur länge har du kroppen längtat Vågar du, vågar du, vågar jag 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 Bogey, 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 Thank you so much. Thank you, Melinda. This, <laughs> thank you. This next song is also in Swedish, and it's about, it's called Pink Sky, Rosa Himmel. Thank 
för någon måste stanna I mean, please
Oh, 
That was breathtaking. Thank you to Ms. Molly Sandin and Circus Circo for that spectacular presentation. And with this, we conclude our official National Day Ceremony of the Kingdom of Sweden. Please join me once again in thanking everyone who has joined us here this morning. And welcome to Expo 2020 Dubai.